I just bought this entire aircraft carrier to spend the night on with my friends. It actually ended up being cheaper to rent out this entire thing than it would be to get a hotel room for all of us. Oh, there she is! Oh. <laughs> that is our hotel for the night. For the whole thing? The entire thing, bro. Thank you so much, World of Warships, for sponsoring and inspiring this entire video. We love you. I grabbed my friends, and once we arrived at the boat, we had to carry all of our stuff up the steepest stairs you could possibly imagine. By us, I mean Willie. You tie. <laughs> <laughs> you got absolutely nothing in your hand, you... Included in the price of $1,500, we got two guides, Faye and Steve, that'd be showing us around the entire ship. I thought it was just gonna be like really like dark, like deserted, this is, like- Like this is actually sick. <laughs> Whoa. The overall vibes in here so far, very hotel. I'd say- no, I wouldn't say hotel. It's like basically a hotel. Can you take your butt? Bro, we could have invited like 50 Whoa. people. There's definitely more beds than a hotel room. Oh, 100%. See, we could have just stayed at a normal hotel we were in town, but the aircraft carrier was actually cheaper to house all of us than it would be to get seven hotel rooms. So my goal today is to compare both to see if you're actually getting a good deal. After looking around our room and putting down our stuff, Faye and Steve led us up to the flight deck where we had a couple of really fun activities planned. Watch your feet and your head. Are we not supposed to look? No, I'm just being very respectful, okay? Oh, okay. No, <laughs> no push. Wow. Holy. Holy. This is nuts. Massive. We're not on a boat right now. There's no way. All right, so I got a little surprise for you guys out on the flight deck, but if you do recognize Julia here, she was Hello. she was actually in our last video. The comment section loved you. Did you see any of the comments? No. All right, we're about to smack some golf balls off the top of this. You never find that in a hotel. I'm really good at golf. I just want to warn you guys right now. Whoa. <laughs> Where'd it go? It disappeared. <laughs> Something like that. We were all having a blast, and I had this really smart idea to run from one side of the aircraft carrier all the way to the other to hit a golf ball as far as possible. Oh, there he goes. Oh, yeah. to scale how big the ship actually is and how mind-boggling the concept that we get to have the whole thing to ourselves is. Ah! Ah! This is it! You missed really bad. You, you stopped, stopped like already. three times. That was an honorable stop. <laughs> <laughs> if you've been watching the channel for a while now, you've probably seen that I've been on this exact ship before, but last time I didn't do a really good job at highlighting what this place has to offer. So this time I'm really gonna be focusing on just that. What's going on here, man? Why is it so cheap? <laughs> How many photos does she need of herself? No, it's okay. It's, I just want it for memories. Check this out. <laughs> what the? F oh, you actually look good, dude. What is happening? That's a beefy boy. Oh, I didn't oh, see you there. Yeah. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't talk to women that often. <laughs> dude, did you think that that was gonna be attractive to take your shirt off and start yeah. doing that? <laughs> So far, we'd only been there for an hour, and I'd say there's about 10 additional things offered at this aircraft carrier that you wouldn't get at a hotel. Golf, 500 beds, Faye and Steve. Well, that's just the tip of the iceberg. No pun intended. All right, we're on the way back in. It's super cold. I think I'm gonna order some pizza. See if they deliver it here. Uh, can I just get uh, six pizzas to the USS Hornet, please? Oh, here it is. Oh, it's like- Oh my gosh. The aircraft carrier has delivery, so. I mean, it's still part of par with the hotel room, I'd say. And we have a whole cafeteria to ourselves. After finishing up on the fourth floor, I had Tyler set up the surprise that we'd have on the fifth right, floor. So I actually did set up a projector that we'll be able to watch movies on, play games on, all in our living quarters right here. What's good, baby? What are you up to? I'm actually playing World of Warships. All right, here we go. Taking off. you, baby. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. You're not very good at this game. What do you think, Julia? It turns me on. <laughs> that turns me on too. There are over 500 historical ships to play that are spread across 11 different nations, including the one we're on right now. I'm gonna do a cut comparison to this ship and the one in the game. They are identical. I'm like, download this game to earn a free date with me. Download it right now. <laughs> 
I thought you were asleep, I Gavin. Was. I'm downloading World of Warships yeah. right now. Click the link in my description, you'll get 500 free to bloom. Seven days of premium. Two million credits. Tier four ship. And a six point commander. It's $25 worth of value for free. This game is actually on PC, mobile, and console. If you want to get your free credits, make sure to download it on PC. These ships are designed based on historical documents and actual blueprints, so they're super realistic. All you can do is click the link in my description, download it. It supports the channel, and you get to play a free, awesome game. You know, I always wondered why it was so hard for me to find a boyfriend, but it turns out I just needed a man who played War of Warships. So. <laughs> maybe, maybe send Julia a DM with a screenshot that you've downloaded World of Warships. You might have a shot. All right, we're about to go on a tour of the ship. I do want to let you guys know that it is haunted. So one of the reasons the ship may be a little affordable is it's proclaimed haunted, which generally makes things cheaper. But we wanted to test it out to see if the claims were real. Fane and Steve basically brought a bunch of ghost gear, motion sensors and flashlights that the ghosts are apparently able to interact with. We set them up. We had some pretty cool experiences. Here. Can you? Yep. Hold on. Getting... Wait, I got we're stuff. Getting... We're, getting... were you a member of this ship when it was in service? Oh, wow. Do you like my friend Tylor here? Do you want to do the flashlight for yes, uh, the music box for now? Okay, awesome. Well, I'm glad. This seems to be going swell. So you, do you nice like guy. him? Do you like him more than than me? That wouldn't be possible. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't like me, you set this off, and I'll know for sure, and I'll just shut my mouth. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> <Yay>. <laughs> I'm. <laughs> if, there, if you guys want to talk to me, just let me listen to them, man. What do you mean, no? <laughs> but nothing really terrifying. It was like, you know, it's just some ghost saying what's up. All right, Faye and Steve are showing us the areas that we get to ourselves tonight after they head out. Oh, wow. Oh, no. Why is there a giant hole there? My god. Looks like a demon yeah, claw. <laughs> But um, as far as like what we've experienced, this is pretty active. Right really? Down here. Yeah. After we were done with the ghost tour, Faye and Steve dipped out and we had the entire ship to ourselves. May I remind you that this is this is only $1,500 at a hotel the front desk lady doesn't leave and give you the entire hotel building to yourself. This is definitely a bonus in my opinion. So we're gonna split up. Tyler and I are gonna cover the amenities that are most comparable to that of a normal hotel. And these boys are gonna confirm whether or not this place is haunted. Sam and Julia are testing the sleep quality right now. We'll ask them tomorrow morning if they got good sleep because we're definitely not going to. I call this Gosh. the amenities hunt. <laughs> that sounds good. <laughs> what kind of year is this? Dude, there's no, there's no doors to take a poop. That's, that's just rude, bro. Did you enjoy your life upon the ship? Was it sexually frustrating just being surrounded by dudes all the time? It's a good one, actually. Being surrounded by semen. Oh, baby! They got a Oregon! <laughs> Tyler and I were having a blast. It was actually such a great time. And all the other boys had absolutely no haunted experiences digging around. This is looking really good for the aircraft carrier. They're right above us. Oh my god, another bathroom. Does you? It does me what? Is like a sound? I'm so scared. Let's go to bed. <laughs> All right, get ready for bed, guys. I just wanted to say thank you so much, everyone who's been watching the videos. It is such an honor to make videos for all you guys. We started the subscriber goal of trying to become the most subscribed to Tyler when I had almost no subscribers. And it's crazy to see that we're starting to really actually jump the ladder and get closer and closer to that goal every single video. So if you've been enjoying the videos, definitely, definitely subscribe. Sweet dreams. Hope, hope Willie and the boys are okay. That was some good sleep. Top tier, top tier. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> this place is a coffee machine, just like your normal hotel. This is definitely better than a normal hotel. I feel like it's not even up for debate. Well, look at you right now, look at me. Yeah, I know, I look like sh but, but I feel like that's just part of it, you know what I mean? One out of 10 sleep quality. Give it like an eight out of 10. Five. That was like an 8.5 for me. You guys gotta say bye to the ship. Bye, ship. I would 100% recommend this place to come spend the night on instead of getting a normal hotel. And also, if you've been looking carefully, there's a hidden message in this video. Tell me in the comment section if you saw it.